Kathy, what are some fatal errors that a writer should avoid at all costs? <laughs> wow. <laughs> I, I think one of the things is that you, you need to know that it's not just one script. You have to think about your whole career that you don't just bank all your hopes on this one piece of material. You have to be working constantly and that things don't happen just like that. Uh, one of the things I did on, in my book is I took a survey. I asked all of these writers who c came into the studios and that I worked with, I asked them a you know, couple of questions and one of them was, how long did it take you? How many scripts did you have to write before you either, before something major happened, like you got an agent or that you got an option or so somebody bought something. I interviewed over 200 professional writers. These are not waiter writers, these are professional writers. Only one got her script sold, the first script. Wow. And she said it took five years for her to get a second sale. Wow. Yeah. And the average actually turned out to be eight or nine. Eight or nine scripts. Scripts, okay, wow. So it's, it's, if you have to love what you do, you don't want to be a one script wonder. It doesn't happen very often where somebody only writes one script and that's it and then nothing. They have to be writing constantly and that's what agents and, you know, and um, executives are looking for and producers are looking for. They want to build a relationship. You'll notice that people like Spielberg and um, all the all the big directors, you notice they all, all have the same credits, the same same people for you know uh, cinematographer, script supervisor, you know, and they go to some of the same writers because they have built a relationship with them, because they like their kind of storytelling, because their characters speak the same language that they would like to convey to you know movie viewers, and so being able to have those kind of relationships, it's not just writing, it's also writing the kinds of things that are going to continue that relationship. So uh, I love the fact that, that most of the writers nowadays have a better understanding of that and they, when I, when I see them at, at like Script Fest or Great American Pitch Fest, uh, when I ask them, I always ask them, you know, what else are you working on, just to test them. Nowadays, most of them will say that they have more than one that they're working on. So I guess it's working. I guess they are getting, the, getting that news that you need to have more than one piece of material.